Sage, some final thoughts for us, especially with regard to what the international community, especially working class people, how can they lend their support to the Palestinian cause? Uh, first of all, like uh, think of the Palestinian survivors of Israeli oppression as survivors of Israeli oppression. Like we are not, we are born subject to oppression. We will die subject to, to oppression. It's just like, um, just like people are made to think of slavery as the, the, those two seconds that went on for 400 years and Lincoln came and stopped it. They were blind to the savagery of, you know, slavery. You're witnessing the savagery that Palestinians have been subject to. And you're also, many people go on normalizing this uh, evil norm of blaming the victim, mm -hmm. you know? So many people hold Palestinians responsible right. for the criminal behavior they've been subject to because blaming the victim is still normalized. We're not of a higher nor of an inferior value than anybody else. Second thing, be reminded. <laughs> You know, everyone is born free and equal. The precondition for my freedom and equality is not my behavior. My very existence, that is the precondition. So learn, be aware, and uh, fight oppression where you see it, wherever you see it. Do not support Israeli bus businesses. Like, I would be happy if people support my oppressor because he's my oppressor. But when you support my oppressor despite of his oppression of the Palestinian people, then that puts you on an inferior level. So just please be aware that do not be dragged into making business with Israeli firms and Israeli oppressors despite of their criminal behavior towards the Palestinian people. Just keep that in mind. And on that note, thank you so much for joining me today.